have some really exciting news. I just got engaged. <laughs> I did it, yeah. It's so weird, because like, I have a fiance. Like that word, doesn't that word sound pretentious, right? Like, and scary, okay. <laughs> it's, uh, yeah, because he's scary and... <laughs> It sounds scary. The worst. Like, I. Yeah, okay. Thank you so much. You guys need counseling. I don't know what to say. Couples therapy right here. Okay, okay. Sad. Um, listen, the word fiance is really pretentious in my book, at least. Like, I could be like, oh yeah, my boyfriend and I went to Chipotle. It's like, no big deal, right? But when I'm like, my fiance and I went to Chipotle, it's like, what a fucking bitch. What a bitch. Uh, my fiance and I, uh, we're different, we're different. I'm Persian and uh, he's uh, not, he's not. He's white, he's white. But he loves to tell everybody that he's one 32nd Spanish because his great-great-grandmother was from San Diego. So, <laughs> you know, you know. I'm not gonna take his last name when we get married. I'm not gonna do it. I'm not gonna do it because I already gave up my birth name moving to this country, you guys. Do you think my real name in Iran is Melissa? <laughs> no, it's Ashley, so I'm not gonna... <laughs> I'm not gonna give up my last name to you guys. By the way, his last name is Larson, okay? Do I look like a Melissa Larson? Do I look like I sell essential oils on Facebook? <laughs> Don't answer that, okay? <laughs> Our families are very different too. Our families, like his family, they love talking about their feelings, right? Like, I feel this, I feel that. Let's go to therapy, you know? Therapy is great. Clap if you guys go to therapy, therapy. Therapy, all the white people, all the white people. Therapy is great. Dude, I told my Persian dad I'm depressed, and he's like, eh, don't be. That was it. <laughs> but you can't be depressed in my family. Like, literally everybody in my... My dad is the most depressed person I know, but he literally covers that shit up with cologne. Just like... <laughs> you can't be depressed when you smell like Sauvage. Why do you think they all wear so much cologne, these Persian men? <laughs> Man. And you cannot talk about mental health. I'm like, Dad, I'm pretty sure Uncle Majid is bipolar. He's like, no, 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 no. He's just a cool guy, okay? <laughs> Everything in our family, we show love through food. Everything is through food. Like when my fiance met my family for the first time, oh my God. For breakfast, my mom had an omelet, fresh squeezed orange juice, French toast. For lunch, a rack of lamb. A rack of lamb. Who does that? I was like, Mom, are you trying to fuck my guy? And my guy was so confused. He's like, oh my God, do I have to eat it all? What do I do? I was like, yeah, if you want to fuck my mom, you got to eat it all. Eat it all. Dude, I went over to his family's house for the first time. I was there all day. All day, 5 p.m. rolls around, I'm starving. There was nothing, nothing in that house. I turned to him, I was like, babe, do you have anything I can eat? Anything, like an Altoid, like I will take. <laughs> His mom, the sweetest lady, she turns to me, she's like, I can make you a bologna sandwich. I was like, oh my God, what is this, jail? Like, <laughs> it's a bologna sandwich. No, now we're planning the whole wedding, and oh my God, weddings are ex expensive. Who, who's gonna pay for that? Like, oh, traditionally, it's the girl's family, right? Isn't that, I told that to my dad. I was like, Dad, you're supposed to pay for this. You, he's like, yeah, for sure. We're gonna throw you the most beautiful wedding, yeah, uh, on Zoom, and it's gonna be so, <laughs> so nice. I'll send you guys the link. Y'all are invited to my fucking Zoom wedding. I decided I don't want to have kids. Yep, that's right, you heard me. Thank you so much. Why can't we celebrate women not wanting children just as much as we celebrate motherhood? Why not? Yes, yes. 
Yeah, so we're called Child Free by Choice. I think we need a catchier name, okay? <laughs> like, if you have a kid, you're called mom, right? If you date a guy who has a kid, you're called stepmom. And if you don't have a kid, you're called happy. <laughs> happy. Happy. Three reasons why I don't want to have kids. One, I like my sleep. Two, I day drink, okay? <laughs> And three, my cat is allergic to kids, so I can't, I can't do it. I don't have a cat, but I'm gonna make sure it's allergic to kids, okay? Before I get out of here. You guys, I am so excited to get married. I really am, and I love my guys so much, but I do also miss being single. Like, being single is so fun because you, you have all those mistakes that you made, you know, the heartbreaks and the DMs, right? <laughs> There's a DM that... Um, I, to this day, cherish, and I masturbate to it, and I would love to read to you guys. Would you guys be down? Thank you so much. Thank you so much. Um, this is from a guy, his name is John. He goes, hi, I am looking for a woman who has a lot of body hair. <laughs> Especially on the arms to date, to be friends with, hopefully get married to someday, thank you. Thank you. He wrote, what a Bridgerton gentleman. So I wrote back, obviously. I was like, hi, John. I am looking for a man who has a lot of money, especially in his wallet, to date, to hopefully marry. No prenup, thank you. And then I just attached a picture of like one hairy armpit. <laughs> Uh, anyway, that's my fiance now, and uh, you guys have been amazing.